here what's up bros and bro it's good morning at least this morning I think it's morning what time is it good afternoon or noon time it's literally 12 o'clock noon right now and uh, today we're gonna be working on Regina out here um, I'm going to start taking out the seats and get them in the screen porch and that's so I can take out the car the carpet because I want to clean it and then uh, restain it black um, and then we'll probably be taking out the dash because I want to fix there's two cracks and I want to fix them <clears throat> this crack right here as you see and this crack right here so I'm gonna fix those and then I want to I really was thinking about wrapping this in like an Alcaterra suede kind of like what this is wrapped in down here but in black and probably gonna do the same to uh, the center console piece, like all this. Not this part right here, but just like this this piece, this piece, all this, and probably do part of the doors too. And I was thinking about doing like a. There's this kind of like plush, uh, kind of like square pattern. Uh, stitched pattern square uh, stuff that I was thinking about putting in like right here and then these will be uh, wrapped in a you know vinyl wrap same with uh, same with the door door trim pieces <clears throat> and uh, this piece all this in the middle right here will be wrapped as well and you know these little accent pieces will be wrapped and wrapped, wrapped <laughs> in a kind of like a goldish black carbon fiber wrap, glossy. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, first off, I'm gonna start with uh, getting these front seats out. So I guess let's get to that. I really want to make fix this squeaking door though. It's terrible. Let's get to it. All right, got the door fixed. No more squeaking. I mean, I don't know, I'll click, but no more. <laughs> so, yeah, now it, uh, well, I mean, I am parked on a hill, but with the grease on there, it likes to just close all the way now. Anyways, let's go ahead and, uh, get to taking out this interior first I'm gonna go ahead and knock out these front seats it's literally just four bolts uh, holding them in so let's go ahead and get those out One seat down onto this passenger side seat. Oh man, <laughs> look how dirty that thing is. That's the driver's seat. Now I am going to be replacing these with new uh, aftermarket, you know, eBay racing seats. I know I shouldn't go with eBay racing seats, but hey, this is a budget build, so I'm not trying to buy anything too expensive. So I'm trying to make this a nice clean daily. This car isn't getting tracked, at least I'm pretty sure I'm not going to track it. But with that said. Let's get on to taking some more of these interior pieces out so I can get the carpet out. Next up, I'm going to start taking off these trim pieces on both sides, and then I'll take out that center console piece right there. And then at that point, 
I don't have the dead pedal in, so I don't have to worry about that. Uh, this is pretty much not really held in by much back here. So it's kind of just tucked up underneath there. I should be able to pull it out, but those, <clears throat> I gotta take the seat belts out at the bottom, unbolt them. And then, uh, should be able to fish the carpet around this, maybe? Yeah, should be able to fish the carpet around this lever. But let's get to it, let's get to it. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, finish taking the rest of those things off, off camera. And when we're ready to take that carpet out, we'll get back on camera. <laughs> Alright guys, so seats are out and center console's out. Now it's time to get this the rest of the way up. Fish this around that. There we go. Carpet. There we go. There we go. Oh, look, more change. More change for me. I'll get this all cleaned up. Looks like we got a little bit of surface rust right here. Right around over here. The floor looks good. I don't see no rust on the floor. Other than, you know, where the bolt's screwed in at. And the sound deadening over here. Breaking apart. Whatever this, yeah, the sound deadening stuff. Actually, I have some roofing tar I might throw on there. Just to kind of, oh, kind of get it back into that form, or not. We'll see. Oh, yeah, the floor looks good, solid. No rust going on. It's freaking awesome. Got more change. More change. It's gonna go to my race piggy. <laughs> All right. Now for this thing. Carpet. Yeah, you can see it's filthy over here. And over there. Yeah, I need some cleaning. <laughs> Definitely need some cleaning. So that is actually what I... I might do that today. Yeah, I guess I might as well do that today. Get it cleaned up. Hair and face. Uh, put the seats inside the screen patio and... Yeah. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and take the seats inside the screen patio. Take this closer up front and then uh you know maybe get some soap on it or something give it a nice good cleaning and then we'll go from there I don't have any to dye with me right now so I can't dye it uh but I can dye it after it's dried and cleaned so or cleaned and dried uh I'm not going to really do much with the front seats other than vacuum all the crap out of off of it I'll probably come out here with the vacuum cleaner and uh, vacuum all the crap that was in the fell off the carpet into the floor. So, with that said, looks like that might be it for this ips this episode. The next episode, I'll be taking out the dash. So, that should be fun. Well, I already got the majority of stuff that I need to get out of the way, anyways. Just a few bolts to take out for the dash. I might do that this video. We'll see. All right, guys. So I got the carpet cleaned. As you can see, it's it's kind of hanging up there on the 
Yep, let me refocus that. So yeah, it's over there. Drying, <laughs> but clean now. And now the refocus. So once that gets all dried and everything, what I'll do is I'll buy some uh, carpet dye and re-dye it black just so it's all one uniform color and not not one uniform color. <laughs> so uh, <clears throat> that's probably where I'm going to end this video, guys. Make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. Until next time, peace out and never look back.